Hi everyone, Radhe Radhe. Um, I got very very late today, and so I'm shooting this very late, and then I'm going uh, very early morning to Mangal Arati as I've been going lately. And uh, this weekend is um, it is a year, annual thing called Anand Mela, which is a two-day event that is hosted by ISKCON. And so we've, I've been going to the temple. There's a lot of work that happens uh, just before Anand Mela. A lot of, lot of work that happens. So, um, yeah, I've been going and I need to work again. So I'm going to keep this short today. Um, it is a very important verse, though, that, like the previous verse, where Bhagavan Sri Krishna is very clearly talking about himself and surrendering unto himself. Like, as him as God, it is very clear and uh, it is one of those few verses in the Gita where he is just absolutely crystal clear about that. So it, he did that in the previous verse as well and he's continuing that today in 3.31, chapter 3, verse 31, which we will do right now. So let's sing this. <coughs> Ye me matam midam nityam anotishthanti manava shradhavanto nasuyanto muchyante te pikarma bhi And uh, the meaning also is beautiful. Those persons who execute their duties according to my injunctions and who follow this teaching faithfully without envy become free from the bondage of fruitive actions. So, um, so anyone who executes their duties according to what I say and follow this teaching faithfully will become free from fruitive actions, will free, become free from the karm kand. Okay, so Ye me matam idam nityam, those who, me, matam injunctions, idam nitis, as an eternal function. These nityam, well, nityam means like diligently, I think. So, um, anatishthanti, execute regularly, manava, human beings. So, those who, human beings who, as an eternal function, as, as, uh, Faithfully, here is the, in the translation it's using faithfully, execute regularly, also there, um, my injunctions. These are my injunctions. Shraddha vanto nasuyanto, with faith, shraddha with faith, vanto with devotion, anasuyantaha, without envy, with faith, devotion, and without envy. Muchan te te pi karma pi. Become free of all of them from the bondage of fruitive actions. Um, so, yeah. So, become free from all of the bondage of fruitive actions. Um, those people who execute their duties according to my injunctions and those who follow this teaching faithfully without envy become free from the bondage of fruitive actions. So let me read this one. Bukhandan those who abide by these teachings of mind with profound faith and free from envy are released from the bondages of karma. Okay, so here um, are become free. Yes, are released. And then here um, profound faith. So those who abide by these teachings with profound faith. Let's see which one. Shraddhavantaha. So Shraddhavanta. Here is translated as with faith and devotion. Yeah. And here is he's saying profound faith. Okay. Um, so yeah, that's it for today. We'll do chapter 3, verse 32 tomorrow. Wish you all a very, very beautiful day. Radhe Radhe.